Carnival Cruise Lines is making plans to set sail again in just a matter of months. CBS 4's Joan Murray has more on the just released plans. Carnival's newest ship, the Carnival Horizon. It's an incredible place in the middle of the sea that brings out the fun. Carnival's Horizon has all the bells and whistles. The ropes, of course. Now I've shown you the ropes. Copy. Finally, there's Dr. Seuss Waterworks. You're now free to move about the cat hat. It's one of eight Carnival cruise ships slated to start sailing again in August. The company announcing they are taking a measured approach in light of the pandemic, laying out a roadmap. Carnival's horizon, magic, and sensation will leave out of Port of Miami. North of us at Port Canaveral, Carnival's breeze and elation will be docked. And in Galveston, Texas, three ships will relaunch Carnival's dream, freedom, and vista. Oh, and lots of fun like the Seaside Theater, movies under the stars, wow. The ships are inviting, but question is, can passengers get past recent cruise nightmare scenarios? I feel sorry for the people that are on that ship. Like the Zandam, which had trouble finding a port with sick passengers, finally docked at Port Everglades, and also the Costa cruise ships that docked in Miami. Lorraine Morvero, who has cruised before, says it may be a year before she's ready to cruise again. I think people are ready. I really, you know, I think we have a lot of fear. I think that fear is going to, it's going to be a while before we all get over it. I think we need more information. I think they need to study it. I think we need, you know, a lot of the scientists to figure out exactly what it is, and I think they're just not, they're unsure. We asked Carnival what people can expect in this coronavirus age. They said they are still putting together the protocol for crew, for passengers, and the safety of the community. In Fort Lauderdale, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.